Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is Saturday morning. I am heading out right now. I'm gonna go get my nails done. They need to be filled so bad, so I'm gonna go do that. Possibly run a couple errands while I'm out and childless. JJ is staying with Fred this morning, and then this afternoon we're going to grocery shop and this weekend we are working on getting the last few things that we need for baby and just getting a couple of things together. He's going to make a little name announcement sign for her so I think he's gonna work on that this weekend and we're just gonna try to get ready for her and then chill out as you can see it's like wet and rainy all weekend so we're not gonna be out doing much but I just thought I would vlog and kind of take you guys along with us preparing for baby this weekend. If you guys are new to my channel my name is Amy I'm currently 35 weeks pregnant with my first baby girl and I do have an 18 month old son named JJ. And I do all kinds of like mommy content, cleaning videos, and a bunch of pregnancy related videos right now. So if you guys are new, make sure you subscribe down below and give this video a thumbs up. So I just got done getting my nails done. I got this like, kind of like orangey brown color and it's got a little bit of glitter in it. I was gonna get black, but I decided to go a little bit different. I saw this color and I thought it was really cute for like fall time, so I got this one and I do actually really like it. So I'm glad I got it. The next couple times I go, I'm probably gonna get my nails like white or like a nude color because that's what I want it to be when I go into labor. So I thought I would do something a little bit different this time because the next couple times are gonna be kind of like plain. So, but I do really like it. So I think I'm gonna go by the Dollar Tree now. There's a couple things that I want for my hospital bag. So I'm just gonna grab that while I'm out and while I don't have JJ with me. Oh, I also stopped at Starbucks on my way. My drink is like gone now. But I got the salted caramel mocha frappuccino, which I never had before and I was a little iffy because I didn't know if I was gonna like it. I usually, just get like mocha or like a java chip. This was actually really good. I really liked it as well. We just got back home from grocery shopping. I'm about to, so I am about to just put all the groceries away. We bought some stuff to make burgers on the grill tonight because it stopped raining, so it's actually really nice outside. So we might also like take JJ for a walk to the park and let him play for a little bit. He didn't really nap today. He fell asleep in the car though, so he got like a 20 minute nap, so that's fine with me because he didn't even wake up till 9.30. So I think he's gonna be good for the rest of the day. But yeah, I'm about to put away the groceries. JJ is in here playing with his cars. Are you playing with your cars? Hey, dude. So I just got done washing these dishes and cleaning up the kitchen a little bit. It looks so much better. But I thought I would show you guys what I got from Dollar Tree earlier. I got more of these little baggies. These are what I meal prep JJ snacks in like pretzels and cheddar puffs and things like that. I just put them in these little baggies and it's like the perfect portion for him. And then the other things that I got were aloe vera gel and and witch hazel. So I'm gonna use these two together to make padsicles. Probably not yet, I'll probably do those in a couple weeks, but I wanted to grab it and just have it already for whenever I wanna make them. But I got them at the Dollar Tree because I was at the store the other day and just a thing of aloe vera was like $5 from Target. So I thought I would check there and they did have both of them. So I'm gonna use these to make the padsicles for postpartum.
Okay, so I'm going to show you guys my to-do list of things that I have to do left before she is here. JJ's over here eating as well as the puppies. So if you hear guys, so if you guys hear some noise, that's what it is. I need to wash all of her swaddle blankets and regular blankets because I haven't done that yet. I also need to wash my nursing cover and my Moby wrap because I just pulled those out of storage yesterday. So I need to wash those. And then I'm gonna put together her diaper caddy with like diapers, a couple extra onesies wipes and like some diaper cream and pacifiers and that's going to be out like in the living room for us so we don't always have to run back to the bedroom to grab stuff i'm also going to do a postpartum basket that has most of what is going to go in here i'm going to get from the hospital such as the numbing spray that they give you as well as the medical grade honey because that helped me a ton postpartum with jj was the honey that they was the honey that they gave us so but I'm gonna put like some pads, my belly wrap, and probably like witch hazel and a few other things in there. And then I'm gonna make some padsicles. I've started packing my hospital bag and JJ's overnight bag, but I need to finish those. Because if I go into labor before my due date, we won't have family here. So JJ will go stay with a friend of ours. So I need to pack him an overnight bag just in case. And then I need to sanitize my breast pump. And then I want to deep clean and disinfect pretty much everything in the apartment. So that's probably what I'm going to be doing the next couple of weeks. I'd like to have everything done around maybe like 38 weeks just in case she comes early. But yeah, so that's my list right now. It is obviously the next morning. I have not gotten ready or anything yet. Today we are going to go and buy a big box of diapers. Buy me a couple more nursing bras because I only have one. And just get a couple other like small things. Um, I wanna get some new baby washcloths so that she has like brand new washcloths to use so she's not using JJ's old ones when she's first born. And then also we need some diaper rash cream for her because I just want I just want a new one for her instead of instead of using the one that JJ uses right now. I just wanna get her a new one for her. And I think there's a couple other things on my list but I can't remember right now, but we're gonna go do that later today. Kind of finish buying everything and then I can start just getting everything ready here. So we just got back from Target and Walmart. We got lunch while we were out as well. JJ's over there being crazy. Careful. But I will show you guys really quickly what all we picked up. Yeah, but we pretty much just got like all of the last few things that we needed for her. So now it's just kind of like getting everything ready in the apartment. Okay, so we picked up, these are not pregnancy related, obviously. They are natural filled bones for the puppies and they got like peanut butter in the middle. They love these. So we got each of them, one of those. And I also picked up these earrings. I just thought they were like really cute. They were only like three bucks. So I just thought they were really cute. But I picked up some of this evening Primrose Oil tablets. I did not use these with JJ, but I've heard that they help to kind of have an easier labor. And some people said that they help them not to tear as well. So I'm probably going to start taking these around maybe 37, 38 weeks. But I just decided to go ahead and pick them up while we were like grabbing all of the last few things. And they're just like little capsules. So I'll start taking these in probably about two weeks. Also from Walmart, I picked up this three pack of baby washcloths and they're pretty soft. So I think they will be perfect for her. And of course they're pink so that I know who's are whose. And then I grabbed a Desitin diaper rash cream. This is the only diaper rash cream that ever worked on JJ. So I got this for her. I just got a two ounce one just so that she has like her own new one to use. I got this little thing of almonds to put in my hospital bag. As you guys saw yesterday, I got a couple like protein bars and stuff for my hospital bag, but I wanted to throw these in there as well because I love almonds. And then also for my mind, I got this two pack of nursing bras. They're just like really soft. They have padding as well, so that's nice, but they're really like soft and comfortable. They don't have any clasp in the back which I really like. And I've heard some people say that they really, really liked these nursing bras. 
So I got these and it was a two pack for $15. So that's like super affordable for nursing bras. So there's a pink one and a black one. And the last thing we got is a big pack of newborn diapers. So this is 108 diapers, newborn size. These are the ones I use for JJ as well. And I just really like the up and up Target brand diapers. So we got these for her. So we are pretty stocked upon diapers for a while. Okay, so the last thing we're gonna kind of be doing today is we have these circular, they are plywood circles. I just picked them up at Hobby Lobby. And Fred is going to make like a name announcement sign for her since we aren't announcing her name until she's here. So he's just gonna put her name like up here. And then he's gonna do a couple lot, like just like lines across here and then do like date, time, length, and weight. So we can put like all of her birth stats on here as well and then just like have it for, and then I can just like put it in her room or something after she's born. So, and then it'll be like her name announcement and birth announcement kind of all in one. So he's gonna make that. And then I'll just put this in her hospital bag and take it with us and then just fill it in after she's born with all of her birth stats. But I'm not gonna share him making it obviously because you guys cannot see what her name is. But that is going to be it for today's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. There will be a bunch of vlogs coming up. I'm going to start baby watch probably around 37 or 38 weeks. So there will be a ton of vlogs then. So if you guys are not subscribed already, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss all of the baby videos coming up. And if you enjoyed today's vlog, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye.